But first, we want to get over to News 10's Rondra Moore. He's in the studio. He spoke with a doctor at Union Hospital in Terre Haute. He joins us now with more on what he's learned about the first confirmed case in Vigo County. Patrice, it is important to note that this is a very fluid situation. We're hoping to learn even more details in the days ahead. But I want to recap what we know so far. A patient from Terre Haute had been self-isolating, showing symptoms of COVID-19. That patient was tested. Just this afternoon, the hospital got results back that the patient had in fact tested positive for the virus. Health officials say they notified the patient first and then members of the community who may have been exposed. They say tonight that patient is recovering at home doing quote pretty well. They cannot release any other information on that patient at this time. Now earlier today I spoke with Dr. Jackie Holder with Union Medical Group. She says they anticipated the situation and were prepared. She wants folks to know the community's being well-being is a top priority. No one could be 100% for something that we've never seen before. But um, having that little opportunity for us to take our time, make some plans, and be thinking two and three steps ahead, um, that has been our main focus to make sure that we're prepared um, for this community um, and, and surrounding communities. Dr. Holder said there are several other tests that are still pending. She says it's possible that more tests will come positive. That's why she's stressing the community not panic, but take this seriously. Stay home whenever you can. Union officials say they'll continue working with the Vigo County Health Department to keep you informed. Patrice, back to you.